Hello everybody and welcome back. This is yours truly, B9400. In today's episode, I will be discussing the life, legacy, and achievements of the 35th president, John Fitzgerald Kennedy, who was a member of the Democratic Party and prestigious Kennedy political clan, who was also unfortunately assassinated, officially making him the third sitting U.S. president in history to be assassinated while serving his term. Let's get into it, shall we? John Fitzgerald Kennedy, JFK, was the 35th president of the U.S., serving from January 20th, 1961, until his assassination on November 22nd, 1963. He is widely remembered for his charismatic leadership, his eloquent speeches, and his vision for a new era in American politics, especially during the Cold War. Here are some key aspects of JFK's presidency and legacy. Early life and political rise. John Fitzgerald Kennedy was born on May 29, 1917, in Brookline, Massachusetts. Kennedy came from a prominent and politically connected family. His father, Joseph P. Kennedy Sr., was a wealthy businessman and diplomat, and his mother, Rose Kennedy, was also from a politically engaged family. During World War II, Kennedy served in the U.S. Navy, where he was a commander of PT boats. His heroic actions after the sinking of PT-109 in the Pacific earned him recognition and medals. Kennedy was eventually elected to the U.S. House of Representatives in 1946 and later to the U.S. Senate in 1952. In 1960, he ran for president and won a close election against Republican Richard Nixon. Major Accomplishments and Events During His Presidency the Cuban Missile Crisis, otherwise known as the Bay of Pigs, 1962. One of the most significant moments of JFK's presidency was the Cuban Missile Crisis, where the U.S. and the Soviet Union came to the brink of nuclear war over the placement of Soviet missiles in Cuba. Kennedy's leadership during this tense period is credited with averting war through diplomacy and negotiations with Soviet Union Premier Nikita Khrushchev. Civil Rights Movement. Where his civil rights record was initially criticized for being cautious, by 1963, Kennedy began to push more assertively for civil rights reforms. He delivered a famous speech in 1963 calling for an end to racial discrimination, which set the stage for the Civil Rights Act of 1964, passed soon after his death. Space Race. Kennedy is best remembered for his vision of American leadership in space. In a 1961 speech, he famously challenged the U.S. to land a man on the moon by the end of the decade, leading to NASA's successful Apollo missions. New Frontier Kennedy's domestic program, known as the New Frontier, sought to address various social, economic, and educational challenges. He pushed for increased funding for education, health care, and social welfare though many of his proposals faced resistance in Congress. Assassination and Legacy On the 22nd of November 1963, while traveling in a motorcade in Dallas, Dallas County, Texas, Kennedy was shot and killed. His death shocked the world, and the subsequent investigation, overseen by the Warren Commission, concluded that he was assassinated by a lone gunman by the name of Lee Harvey Oswald. However, various conspiracy theories about the assassination persist to this day, just over 60 years later. Kennedy's short presidency is often romanticized due to his youth, idealism, and tragic death. His speeches and ideals, particularly his call to service, ask what your country can do for you, ask what you can do for your country, in Berlin, Germany, continue to inspire people worldwide. That just about concludes today's episode. Thanks for tuning in. It's very much appreciated. Make sure to switch on the uh, notification bell in order to receive regular updates from me. Uh, and make sure to subscribe as well as it helps me out considerably in terms of expanding my brand name. Until next time, this has been yours truly, B9400. Thanks for tuning in.